everyone, it's Sally. Um, I was away for a month because I was just busy. I haven't had time to make videos or anything. This is, it was my busy year and exciting things happen, but I'll bring those up. So I did get some new books, yes, but I mostly spent money, my last, my, most of my entertainment money on um, a con concert tickets. So I'm gonna go see Andy Black from Black Veil Brides in a month, and I'm like, so excited. So I'll get to be doing that, and of course, during my free time while re waiting, I'm gonna be reading, but in the month of February, I read four books, and, and then I have a TBR for the re books I'm reading, gonna be reading, well, have I have read one so far, but re the rest I'll be reading for the month of March, as my March, as my March reading month. Um, so, let's, so as for the February, my February TB wrap up in March TBR, let's get started. So the first book I read in the month of February was King of Scars by Leah Bardugo. I loved this book, even though it took me a week to read because I was so busy most of the time. But I did love this book. I It blew me away. Wonderful job, Leah Bardugo, as always. I give this like a five out of five stars, an A plus, definitely, 100%. I would say, I would probably say 99, 100% because it was so good. The next book I read, if I can even it out, I read Hunted by Megan Spooner. This one I held up, I took me a year to get, and I, and I, it took me maybe a week as well because of my busy schedule. I liked this book. It was, surprisingly, it's a standalone. Her other book is another retelling, so I thought it was a second book, so I had that mixed up, so... That's the book I, that's the second book I read for the month of February. The next book I read was a manga book, which is Tokyo Ghoul Volume 2. I love the Tokyo Ghouls. I just got into these. Oh my god. If I weren't, if it weren't for these, I probably wouldn't have known manga books very well. So I read this like in two and a half hours because I had nothing. I just did nothing for two and a half hours and read it. The last book I read in February, finally I've been wanting to read this, Two Dark Reigns by Kendara Blake, the third book in the Three Dark Crowns series. Now I can be caught up and get excited for the finale in September. So, I'm super excited. This got left me on a cliffhanger, so I'm just like, oh, I want the final book now, but we have to wait, so... Yeah, we all have to wait. So that's the books I read in the month of February. So here are the books I'm reading in the month of March. One, The one I just finished reading, I'm going to show you now, is The Hate You Give by Angie Thomas. If I can show you guys more. There it is. This is the collector's edition. I read this book like within four days. I started like, well, I started the end of February and I didn't finish till early March. So it was because Sarah March read. And I finished it Sunday night, March 3rd. Yeah, about that. It was really good. I It was a nonstop reading. Like I couldn't stop reading it. I was so happy I got to read the book finally. I didn't see the movie yet but I might rent it out of the library one day and see it I haven't decided because with me it's always it's always the books are better than the movie if you think movies are better than the book let me ask you this question what the hell is wrong with you exactly so books are better than the movie my opinion so the book I'm currently reading now in the March TBR is Unravel Me by Tara Mafi. I think that's what you say her name, Tara Mafi or T yeah, Tara Mafi. I can't 
say surnames right. Um, so I remember faces, but I don't know names really well. So this is the second book in the Shatter Me series. I have the third book, Ignite Me. I should have brought that down. Crap, because I want to read that too. And I'm currently reading that, so... Re well, reading this, and it's... I started it that Sunday night before bed, and I'm getting... I'm, like, hooked to it as I was to book one, so it was nice. The next book I'm going to read after that is War Cross by Marie Lu. And this one, I think it's a kind of like a video game verse. So that's so kind of almost like Ready Player One, I'm guessing. But this is a signed copy. Let me show you the signature. It's not, it's not the greatest, but here's the signature, if you can see it briefly. That's the signature. So yeah, I'll be reading that as well for the month of March. The next book I'll be reading the month of March, I just got this at, my mom got me this at Target one day when I was meeting with her friend, Fangirl by Rainbow Rowell. It's kind of about this girl who's going to college and what is it about, let me see. She likes this whole series and now she's going to college. So I'm going to be reading that and see how that is. The next book I'm reading in month of March, I got this for Christmas, is Damsel by Elena K. Arnold. So I can see how this book trilogy or series is going to be. And then the last book, Winter Glass by Alexa Hillier. I need to finish spindle fire so the spindle fire duology so i kind of know what happens next i am going to read the other two that you saw in the previous video if you haven't seen the previous video go on my page it's on there it's on consider as my january wrap up and february tbr so that it's on my page if you just click down my name my pay my i can't speak if you click down on my channel below channel name below you'll see my page and then that's where you'll find more videos and you'll find the previous video of those two books i was talking um i talked about yeah so those are my that's my february wrap up and march tbr so just to let you guys know, I have a lot of books to read, yes, but as of right now, I don't have I am I have one more book from my gift card balance I had left over. I used the rest of it on this book. It's The Shadow Glass by Rin Chebeko, which is the finale of the Bone Witch trilogy. I'll be putting that in my March TBR probably too, because I want to know what happens. I've been dying to know. Well, not really honestly dying. I just want to know what happens. Um, so, I, I'm, like, like getting Broken Throne and the other books I want that are coming soon, I either have to wait till I save up after spending so much money on the concert tickets, or I have to wait till my birthday in September. So, it just depends, um, so it depends, um, basically, I'm out of entertainment funds for the next few months, basically. And I used up my gift card money, so I can't really buy anything right now, so. Except stuff I need, like food, clothes, shampoo, that stuff, yeah, but. Books, games, um, fun stuff like getting my hair done or, or going to other concerts, I have to wait. Because, I'll tell you this, doesn't it suck being an adult? You think... Being young as a young kid is all fun and games for a while, but once you're an adult, the shitty starts begin. The shitty shit begins. Like I tell you, teenagers, don't grow up. It's a trap. I keep telling you, you guys will stop growing. That's okay. I didn't stop growing either. Now I'm aging. I'm going to be 26 in September, so now you guys know 
it's good to enjoy the moments you have before it's too late, so enjoy it. Other than that, hope you all have a good day. Until next time.